According to an indictment returned last week and unsealed this morning, former Chicago Police Commander John Burge broke the law when he was supposed to uphold it. According to the indictment, former Commander Burge, while working in Area 2 as a detective, later a sergeant, and then a lieutenant, participated in and witnessed the abuse of people in police custody. Make no mistake about it, the people in police custody that were abused and tortured were suspected of awful crimes. Make no mistake, some of them may have been guilty of awful crimes, but that is no excuse. Torture and abuse have no place in the Chicago Police Station. The statute of limitations on that torture and abuse has long since passed. But former police commander Burge also filed lies, um, submitted lies of some under oath in a federal civil rights lawsuit in 2003. And for his lies about this torture and abuse, we intend to hold him accountable. Burge was indicted uh, in an indictment that charges two counts of obstruction of justice, each with a maximum penalty of 20 years and one count of perjury. According to these charges, John Burge shamed his uniform and shamed his badge. But the last time he wore that uniform and that badge was more than 15 years ago. It's important that the public respect that when we bring these charges, they should not judge the people who walk the streets uh, in a uniform and badge today uh, to try and serve and protect, that we not judge them based upon the conduct of someone else who hasn't worn that badge or that uniform.